What's up you beautiful people? Thank you so much for tuning in. Today I have another video for you. In this video, what we're gonna do is all the van electrics in the couple of uh, in the next couple of days. So you can see there's one panel behind me. I'm gonna start by installing that one. I'm very excited for this video because this is one of my favorite parts is um, dealing with electrics and stuff. There's going to be two ways to charge the battery which is gonna power everything in the van the first one will be from the solar panels the second one will be from a dc to dc charger basically it takes the power from the alternator it's gonna detect when the engine is on and it's gonna charge the battery <laughs> So last night uh, the GoPro died. I couldn't record anything. So what I've done is wow, wow, <laughs> it's just Jess playing around with. Hello. Okay. How are you? How are you? What I was able to do last night: mount the uh, solar charge controller, just and the uh, and the fuse box, AC, MCB as well. Now what I'm trying to do now is just do all the connections. So as you can see, I've made one of the cables which will go from the battery to the bus bar over here. And from here, everything's gonna connect the inverter, the charge controller, uh, and the DC to DC charger. Now for the challenging part, that is, I have to install this DC to DC charger. It's challenging because I have to take a wire from the car's battery, which is right in the front. I have to basically take two wires from that battery from there, going down here and through here to the uh, to the electricals. I've got my drill over here, and I'm gonna drill a hole and get the cables through here all the way like that to the cabinet okay so i did manage to make a hole big enough through there it's kind of a tight fit as you can see so i'll just use the, the silver foil uh, tape for now uh, yeah, and then I will try and make it look nice. so how do i look because i got a new camera man i got the nikon z30 which is recording me right now i'm so excited for it the video looks so much better like so so much better from the gopro all right going back to the video i have now completed the electrics but not not all the connections have been made but um basically all the major components like the like the chargers the batteries the inverters everything like that is done the brain of it all is this guy the Rena G1M so what it does it connects to the Wi-Fi and then you can view this on the mobile app 
and you can basically see how much the wind is using what's your battery percentage okay so this is our battery goes uh, the current from the battery goes to the switch to a junction which is called a bus bar okay negative terminal goes to another bus bar for the negatives and this is the solar controller okay the solar panels are connected to this one and then the output of this it flows back to the battery and uh, you also have a dc to dc charger uh, which charges the battery and when the engine is on it detects that automatically the input over here and the output over here these two wires which goes to the battery again right and everything is fused like you can see if i turn this off then it's not getting any current and then you have the inverter which takes the power from the battery and converts it to 240 volts uh, which means you can use these switches and you can use like normal appliances and this is the small fuse box and all the appliances don't connect straightly straight to the batteries they connect to the junction box and they are fused individually so if anything goes wrong nothing over here gets um, uh, set on fire or anything like that the fuse will pop everything is safe and this one is the AC circuit breaker anything happens with the AC this trips again nothing gets set on fire I hope that was not too confusing it's quite simple just a battery one inverter to convert it to this one so we can use normal appliances there's one charge controller which takes the solar panels charges the battery and there's one dc charger which is connected to the van's battery and whenever the van is on it just charges the battery that way so that's about it and it's all fused it looks complicated but it's really very very simple okay right I think that's it for this video okay, and I'll see you in the next one if you could just subscribe to my channel that'll mean a lot to me bye bye guys yes.